Kawasaki, Ducati, Honda and Honda through the corkscrew. And in fifth place, it's Jamie James on the Vance and Heinz Yamaha heading down the hill. Onto the start and finish straight, Scott Russell with just a two bike length advantage over Doug Polan on the factory Ducati. And Freddie Spencer's off at the corkscrew. Freddie Spencer overdoing it at the corkscrew. Going straight on, and that's not a very wise idea. So Freddie Spencer tumbling out of third place. But the former world champion getting back into the thick of the action, fighting his way back up the leaderboard if he possibly can. A mistake from Freddie Spencer, but back into the action. Meanwhile, the battle for first and second is still being slugged out between Scott Russell and Doug Polan. They're side by side going into the corkscrew. And it's still Russell leading. Poland in second place. The Japanese Kawasaki being hounded by the Italian Ducati every step of the way. But it's still the Californian leading. The Texan in second place. And through goes Poland under the braking. It's Poland that leads. Just leaving his braking that split second longer. And he goes through to take the lead in the second round of the AMA Superbike Championship here at Laguna Seca. Doug Poland from Scott Russell. It's the Ducati man out front and he's opening an advantage now at the head of the field through the left and right-handed downhill sweep of the corkscrew, one of the most awesome corners in world racing. It's Doug Poland out front. Oh, and Poland there almost being brought to grief by a back marker, a much slower rider. But he eventually gets safely through onto the start and finish straight. And it's victory for Doug Poland in round two. The Ducati man wins. A superb win for Poland.